this is Misha at MK and I'm going to be talking about the MK cleaning kit today. I should say this is, I'm going to be using an MK chameleon here for demonstration but this kit will work with any low whistle, uh, tunable, non-tunable, it, uh, it, it, it's, it's good for them all. So I'm going to start with the, the top end of the instrument. So we have, um, this is a tunable instrument, I'm just putting together here, but we have the top end here which is where the, where the airway is and that obviously is where we blow through, it has, uh, we have moisture in our breath and that can collect up gunk as you know we play. Uh, so it's actually probably one of the areas that we want to clean the most often. So what we've got for that is we have some felt pull throughs here which are really a very simple idea it's just a piece of felt and they come with this kit it's a piece of felt that's thin at one end and wider at the other and we can feed that in to the the end of the airway and <coughs> We can pull that up until the, the sides of the <coughs> of the felt pull through hit the sides of the airway. Now we can pull that backwards and forwards, which will give the airway all the way into the corners a nice clean. Now I will say that a little bit of moisture in there does help loosen everything up. So if we play for a little while before we do this, that's useful. But also, we have a cleaning sterilizing solution here that we can actually spray onto the felt pull through. And as we pull that up into the airway, that will help loosen everything up, clean and sterilize it. These are part of the pack, but I will say that they, they are reusable. We can stick them in the washing machine, uh, clean them with warm soapy water. Um, <clears throat> so they should last a good a good while. Next up, we have the these cotton buds, which there's really nothing special about these at all. Wooden handled cotton buds. Uh, we have uh, sort of slightly smaller ones, and then um, slightly bigger ones. Now, <clears throat> these are more difficult to, to to clean and reuse, but they are readily available. So it should not be too difficult to, to replace in the kit. Um, what we use these for is just the inside of, if we look in the window of the instrument, there's a, there's a, there's a chamber in there and the, you know, there tends to be sort of corners that things can, can gunk can accumulate. We can get in there with these just to, just to clean that out giving again a little bit of a spray of the Wistol in either into there or onto the cotton buds just before we use them helps to loosen everything up and keep it nice and clean. <coughs> so that's the airway and the, the inside of the chamber and then we've got, or the top end of the, of the bore if you like, the bore itself is traditionally quite difficult to clean because it is a long thin instrument it's difficult to get in there with the cloth so for that we've created this uh, cleaning mop that we've got here which has a handle and then the, the, the head of the mop and that can actually go inside the the <coughs> the bore of the instrument and we can give it a twist there just to clean out the inside we can obviously again use a bit of the Wistol a squish either on the mop itself or inside the bore. Now, if this was a non-tunable instrument, it would be one piece. So what we've got there, we have an extendable part, an, an additional section, so we can unscrew the handle and we can add in this section so that this mop becomes much longer and that can get all the way inside the, the bore of a non-tunable instrument. For the tunable, like this low D, or you know low F, or whatever, we can actually keep it in its short, <coughs> in short mode, and we can just 
get that get right inside the bore from one end or from the other end. And again, a little bit of whist all will help just to loose, loosen everything up in there. So that's the cleaning mop. The head, the head does come off and we can wash it. So, you know, whether we uh, wash that with some warm soapy water or whatever, that is, um, you know, something that means that we can, we can reuse it. The handle itself should actually last for decades. It's really precisely made, uh, made from solid, solid aluminium. And, uh, we, you know, because we can take the, the, the head on and off with these two screws, the handle, even if the mop does eventually need replace, the handle should keep going and going. So we've got the felt pull throughs, we've had the, 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 the cotton buds, we've got the whistle, and this, you know, is also useful for wiping down the outside of the instrument. Generally, we try and avoid suggesting or recommending submerging whistles in water because what can happen is we get a kind of water kind of promotes biological growth, which is really what we're trying to avoid. And uh, this cleaning solution, which is a sterilizer, is, is you know has the opposite effect of that, where it kind of um, it helps keep um, <coughs> kind of things clean and uh, sterilizes at the same time. So, and then finally, something we've probably all come across before, but it's part of the kit as it's uh, important and useful, which is tuning slide grease, and that is just in a in a little stick form. It should last a really good long while. Um, <coughs> we can just push out a little bit of the of the grease, and that just goes onto the slide, just in a very thin smear. Uh, just a few little bits, and then if we actually rotate the head onto and just rotate it round, that helps spread the the grease. Um, just to give it a very, very thin layer. So that can be useful if, which can occasionally happen, we have a slight uh, moisture leak from uh, the slide. This will sort this out straight away. Um, and it also helps create a kind of barrier between the head and the body that stops the two parts corroding together, which is you know particularly useful if the instrument's actually sitting for a while, not being played, that when you come back to it, it's still working uh, really nicely, the parts are moving freely, and it's the tuning side grease that really, really, really helps with that. So yeah, we've had the, the felt pull throughs, the cotton buds, the <coughs> extendable cleaning mop, Westall cleaning solution, and um, <coughs> the tuning side grease. I hope this has been useful for you, and um, <coughs> Of course, if you have any questions, do get back to us or uh, use the comments below and we'll do our best to answer anything that we haven't done in this video. Thanks.